You just sent the most powerful man in Westeros to bed without his supper. You're a fool if you believe he's the most powerful man in Westeros. A treasonous statement. Joffrey is king. You really think a crown gives you power? No. I think armies give you power. Mm -hmm. Rob Stark had one. Never lost a battle. And you defeated him all the same. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know. Walder Frey gets all the credit. All the blame, I suppose, depending on your allegiance. Walder Frey is many things, but a brave man, no. He never would have risked such an action if he didn't have certain assurances. Which he got from me. Do you disapprove? I'm all for cheating. This is war. But to slaughter them at a wedding... Explain to me why it is more noble to kill 10,000 men in battle than a dozen at dinner. So that's why you did it? To save lives? To end the war. To protect the family. Do you want to write a song for the dead Starks? Go ahead. Write one. I'm in this world a little while longer. To defend the Lannisters. To defend my blood. The Northerners will never forget. Good. Let them remember what happens when they march on the south. All the Stark men are dead. Winterfell is a ruin. Roos Bolton will be named Warden of the North until your son by Sansa comes of age. I believe you still have some work to do on that score. Do you think she'll open her legs for me after I tell her how we murdered her mother and brother? One way or another, you will get that girl pregnant. You will not rape her. Shall I explain to you in one easy lesson how the world works? You small words. I'm not as bright as you. The house that puts family first will always defeat the house that puts the whims and wishes of its sons and daughters first. A good man does everything in his power to better his family's position regardless of his own selfish desires. Does that amuse you? No, it's a very good lesson. Only it's easy for you to preach utter devotion to family when you're making all the decisions. Easy for me, is it? When have you ever done something that wasn't in your interest, but solely for the benefit of the family? The day that you were born. I wanted to carry you into the sea and let the waves wash you away. Instead, I let you live. And I brought you up as my son. Because you're a Lannister. 